thing with Eugene the Spirit Dragon. <laughs> Very good. He's a... All right, real quick, uh, this is the culmination of our Spark Madness bracket, which we had up on Hipsters of the Coast. Whoever ends up choosing the winning Planeswalker out of this final four that we are doing today uh, is going to be up for a booster box. We will determine that winner after this stream. Uh, bo booster box War of the Spark, I should say. We will send that out to you, you know, once the set comes out. Uh, here's a look at the bracket. We had over 1,800 people uh, submit brackets. Uh, we took all that data, crunched it down, and this was the most common way that the brackets shook out up to the final four. So it's Jace versus Ugin. Once these finish up, we're going to have Nicol Bolas versus Liliana, and then the winner of those two matches are going to fight to scientifically determine once and for all, forever, who is the best planeswalker. Uh, and you can't argue about it. We're determining it for reals. No take backsies. Cool? Cool. Science. <laughs> all right. Uh, with that, we're just going to shuffle up and get started. Uh, as they have already determined their opening hands, we now just need to roll to see who goes first. Six. Seven. That's one better. That is one better. <laughs> Therefore, I will go first. All right. Yep. Good. A few notes on our format. These are just for funsy decks. They are technically, I guess you would call them legacy legal. They're pulling cards from everywhere. They are just thematic 60-card decks. Uh, you'll notice the Planeswalkers are out in the middle. They kind of work like commanders. Uh, the players can cast them whenever they have the mana to do so and, you know, can legally cast a Planeswalker. If they die, we aren't doing commander tax, we're doing a cooldown mechanic. So the first time a Planeswalker dies, it goes to the graveyard with one cooldown token. You remove it at the end of your next turn and then you can cast the Planeswalker again. And that keeps going up uh, the more it dies, up to three. So. Fourth, fifth, and sixth times Planeswalker dies, it still only gets three cooldown tokens. Cool? Cool. All right. Let's get going. Oddly enough, I play an island. Island. Sounds Pass. good. All right. <laughs> Draw here. Um, and I will play a mountain. Very <gasps> odd for... I know. For Ugin. Pass turn. <laughs> yeah, designing the land base for Ugin was a challenge. <laughs> I can kind of, kind of figure that one. <laughs> I mean, you just don't want to go all colorless? Uh, it turns out throwing a bunch of ancient tombs into the deck makes it even real good. Ah, oh, <laughs> fair. Fair. Uh, cool. I'm going to cast uh, Jace's Erasure. All right. Whenever you draw a card, I mill one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah, fast turn. I see where this is going. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I will play Planes, and then I will... We'll get this started. Um, I'll cast Tormenting Voice, discarding uh, Ghost Fire. Ooh. And I will draw two cards. With or without plan, no, I will not add City of Traitors instead. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Uh, pass turn. Fantastic. Change up the lighting here a little bit, see if I can get some of the glare. Perfect. Get, cool. that, get that mood lighting. <laughs> Is that Kenny G I hear in the background? <laughs> um, oh, so I drew a card, uh, Mill One. Oh, I will do that. Nope. It is a ghost fire. Oh, bye ghost fire. Too bad. Too bad, too bad. Uh, and then I'm going to go ahead and put out Sex's Tutelage as well. Whenever you draw a card, target opponent puts oh, the top no. two cards of his or her library into a graveyard. If they're both non-land cards that share a color, repeat this process. Do I have and a sideboard? Or? <laughs> <laughs> um, nope. Um, and then for five and a blue, uh, draw a card, then discard a card. Okay. Yep. Uh, that is me, past turn. Well, luckily, I'm playing the colorless deck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> for turn. <laughs> Uh, I will play Haven of the Spirit Dragon, and oh. I'm going to pay two mm -hmm. to cast Mastery of the Unseen. Ooh. It has Ugin on the art. Yeah. Haven of the Spirit Dragon has Ugin on the art, too. I love it. <laughs> and, it and if you're wondering, Tormenting Voice has Ugin on the art, and Ghostfire has Ugin in the flavor text. <laughs> These decks may have been built with the rule of flavor first Oops. in mind. I love it. That is fair. Uh, yeah. Past turn. <laughs> I will also say this is probably one of the best starts that Rachel's deck can have. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm not. I'm not feeling real confident right now. <laughs> yeah. It's what I do. Uh, cool. Then we'll go ahead. Uh, sorry. Uh, drew, drew a card. So uh, no uh, one. Or no, which one do you want to do first? Uh, let's do Jason's erasure first. Okay, no so one. No one. All right, and then mill two. Mill two, and they don't share a color. Don't share a color, so go for it. Uh, and then I'm gonna go ahead and. 
Let's do this. All right, there Jason's he is. Cast, uh, and then I'm going to go ahead and... Yeah, we'll go ahead and plus two him. Uh, so. so we both draw a card? We both draw a card. With or without plan slash Henry, since uh, we call you both on this stream for some reason. No, neither deck has Splinter Twin. <laughs> are, are you uh, giving a plus two? Plus two, yeah. Okay. So, uh, sorry, the way I no, do it, and no I, I do the actual like counters uh, on the die here. Would you rather I did? Uh, yeah, the, the the full. The full. Yes, cool. so that's better. That okay. works. So we both so draw a card. Both draw a card. Uh, and then you mill there's two one. triggers. Do one first, and then, and then mill then two. two, and they don't share a color. Cool, fantastic. And then I'm gonna go ahead and play land for the turn and pass. Okay, I will untap, draw for turn. I will play. Oh, let's see, uh, Dragon Spell. Okay, I have a Dragon Spell, so that's nice. Yay! I'll pay four mana to cast uh, Thunderbreak Regent. Oh, that's a good one. Uh, whenever uh, a dragon I control becomes a target of a spell or ability an opponent controls, Thunderbreak Regent deals three damage to that player. Fair. And that's all I can do. I'll pass the turn back. Fantastic. That's okay. all. <laughs> <laughs> that is all. <laughs> one of the better dragons in the deck. All right, so we're doing the one first. One first. And then two. Then two. They do not share a color. Cool. Play a land for a turn. Uh, let's see here. What do I want to do? Only a region. Uh, we did get a. I think that was a Dragon Lord Dramoka that got milled. Yeah. A second ago. Yep. Sadly. <laughs> by by Jamoka Shake. <laughs> uh, chat says, Adam, your deck is flipping very quickly. You should do something about that. I'm, I'm working on it. <laughs> Tr trying? Hashtag trying. Uh, then, yeah, we're going to go ahead and just do uh, this. I'm going to go ahead and cast Control Magic. Control Magic. Oh, you take three. I take three? Yes. Oh, that's right. Yes, I'm okay please. with that. All right, you can. I guess you but can I, have I, that. I want him. Because well, you have it. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and... Keeping the flavor up, that is the control magic from the Jace versus Chandra duel. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know which camera we're on, so I know she flipped it. Um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and add uh, plus Jace 2, so each of us draw a card. Okay. Um, mill 1. Mill 1, and mm. then mill two. mill 2. And they do not share a color. Fantastic, okay. Uh, and How does Jace break the brain of a gosh darn ghost dragon? Is he just annoying Eugene to insanity? Yes, I think yeah. storyline wise that actually is what happened. I think it's, Sounds his, I think it's his poetry. It really just sits um, very deep inside his soul, so that's what happens there. Uh, and then I'm going to go with Thunderbreak Reach and still have Summoning Sickness. Yes. yes. Like, thank you, Pastor. Right. <laughs> you need to control it through one of oh, your upkeeps. Upkeeps, that's right. All thank right. you. Um, I will play a Swamp. Swamp. Who again? I have come to bargain. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to discard a, discard a mountain with Tormenting Voice and okay. draw two. Okay. And I will pass the turn. Okay. Okay, draw a card. Uh, mill one. Oh, mill one. And mill, then mill two. two. They do not share a color. And they are lands. So that's okay. That's okay. Colorless is not a color. Color, color, color. Mm -hmm. color, color. That's, that's true. Uh, let's see here. So many options. <clears throat> uh, so yeah, we're just going to go ahead and uh, plus two to Jace again. Draw a card. Okay. Mill one. Mill one. And then mill two. I do not share a color. Cool. Um, play island for the turn. <clears throat> and then we're going to go ahead and cast Jason's Mind Seeker. Flying. Uh, when he enters the battlefield, target opponent puts the top five cards of his or her library into her graveyard. You may cast an instant or sorcery card from among them without paying its mana cost. Uh, Crux of Fate. Crux of Fate. <laughs> you may cast it. Oh, what does this one do again? You can destroy all dragons or all non-dragons. It's up to you. Boo. Or not cast it. Yeah, you can <laughs> choose not I, to. I'm not going to cast it. I'm just going right. to let you put that in your graveyard. Uh, so I have another little flying 4-4. Four, four. Um, and then, yeah. Uh, what does this do again? Uh, you... I can pay four mana, including one white, to manifest the top card of my library. Got it. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to... Swing in for four. 
And pass turn. All right. Draw off a turn. Hmm. Indeed. Hmm. All right. Uh, let's see. Um. Um. Didn't want to destroy all non dragons though, because then the mind seeker would die. Leave my mind seeker alone. <laughs> it's I a lovely pay... fish illusion. <laughs> I'll pay four to cast Hedron Archive. Ooh. Very nice. And then. I think that's all I can do. Faster. Uh, oh, draw a card. Um, oh, mill one, one, and then mill two. two. They do not share two a color. Cool. Because Ghostfire is colorless. Ghostfire. <laughs> it says it right on the card. Ghostfire. Very specifically. <laughs> the one time that has ever mattered. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gotta love it. Uh, cool. Behemoths. Um, we're going to go ahead and just do this. Uh, Jace's Sanctum. Okay. It's an enchantment. Instant and sorcery spells you cast cost one less to cast. Great. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, scry one. Nice. Yep. Yeah. Uh, then I'm going to go ahead and plus Jace again, drawing yep. each of us a card. Hooray. No one. No one. No two. two. They do not share a color. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, and you know what? Bunsies, I'll just swing at you in the air. For, for four. For four. I've taken it. Fantastic. It is now right. your turn. Good uh, at the end of your turn, I'm going to pay four mana, two mm -hmm. from the Hedron Archive, and these two to manifest the top card of my library. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That seems good. Would uh, you like to level the tokens? Yeah, I would love to have a manifest say, token. These were this is a, an overlay. Created by, uh, created by our very own Brian Hughes yesterday on the CK Draw st stream. Thanks, Thanks Brian. Brian. <laughs> All right. Thanks, man. We Draw did. Turn. <laughs> All right. Um, I guess I'll play a land first. Unclaimed territory, naming dragon. Um, I have to do this because otherwise I just lose. So let's do this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> Cast Ugin. Eugene. Eugene. Three Kronor. Uh, Spark Madness is a thing we've been running on Hipsters of the Coast. It's basically a March Madness bracket. Uh, where people picked planeswalkers who would win in fights. And this is our final four. Our first match here is Ugin versus Rachel. I'm Chris Cornejo commentating. And yeah. All right. That's what we're doing. So, my first first order of business Ugin says minus six. <laughs> uh, so. Exile each permanent with converted mana cost X or less. That's one or more colors. Cool. So, this gets exiled. And I think you have some things over there getting exiled. Yeah. So it's permanents or? Uh, any permanent that any is permanent. colorless or not colorless. So all your lands are fine. Everything else that you own is not fine. Fair. Yes, I did say Ugin versus Rachel. Rachel had a lot of fans in the bracket, it turns out. She chose Jace. Buy everything. And uh, this one, I'll just grab that. Yeah, so that that's, that's, that goes back to you. I'll put that there. And... Jace is, follows normal command rules, so he goes back to the command zone with one cooldown counter on it, as that's the mechanic we're choosing okay. to use. Okay. So at the end of Rachel's next turn, the cooldown counter goes away, and then Rachel can cast Jace again. Attack for two. Take two. And I have to discard at end of turn because of hand size. <laughs> because of reasons. Because reasons. I will discard a land. <laughs> Pass turn. All right. Okay, so... I don't, I don't have a lot of cards left. <laughs> <laughs> no, but Ugin, it turns out, does a lot of work really fast. So. Yep, it does. So we'll see. Well, we'll see. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Nothing's on fire, and everything's fine. Uh, uh, the sleeves are just the Ultra Pro, Pro Planeswalker symbol sleeves. Uh, they come in 80-count packs. Uh, kind of hard to find now, actually, but we had just enough left in our inventory for me to steal them for the stream and be all thematical about it. Hooray! Hey. <laughs> um. Cool beans, past turn. Thank you, Nifty Chris, for that link. <laughs> all right. 
untap all the business. Mm -hmm. Draw one card for my turn. Oh, look, it's a blue mana. Hey. Nice. We did it! <laughs> Hooray! Domain! <laughs> oh, I don't have green. <laughs> but it's cl it's getting there. We're getting there. You sort of domain. <laughs> Alright, I will plus two Ugin. And I will do three damage to directly to your face. Right to my face? Directly at your face. Alright, and then I'll pay Oops. one, two, three, four, five. Oh, the counter goes away on Jace at the end of your turn. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah so you can cast them. Next and I'll cast Fearsome Awakening. Um... Counterspell. Counter, just counterspell. Yep. Good old counterspell. Just huh? good old uh, counterspell, yep. Yeah. Right. You don't need to be complicated about things. Nope, uh, nope we don't. Uh, okay. And then I'll pay this, this, and a couple of these. One of these is going to be red and green, and I'll cast Harbinger of the Hunt. No. Just another counterspell. Okay, <laughs> that has happened. And then I will attack you for two. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> uh, pass turn. Cool. Uh... We have 19 packs of those sleeves in stock. Well, we just got restocked then. <laughs> <laughs> Darn it. Uh, Ugenstech Modern Legal, uh, mostly? I don't think yeah. there's anything in Ugenstech that isn't. Yeah, I don't think so. Yeah. Based on what I've seen. Jason's deck is very not. Just, you know, not. Oh, there's some counter spells. Counter spell and can, I don't think, has Control Magic been reprinted in a standard legal set? Mm, no. No, I don't yeah. believe so. In a while. <laughs> in, a, in a while. Uh, cool beans. And it's just paying three for my buddy here. All right. There he is. Cool. And then. Oh, and his buddy, other yeah. Jace. They're friends. Yeah. They're, they're friends. Other versions of control magic and control magic y type things have been printed, but not straight up control magic. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, cool. I will pass. Actually, no. Uh, mirror. I'm going to minus one my Jace. Yeah, where's the two? There we go. Uh, to draw a card. Okay, perfect. Uh, and then pass turn. Okay. Why don't we print Control Magic? Because it's real good. Because it's 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 real good. Um, play a land first. What do I want to do? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I only have eleven mana. Only. That's not only. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> it's not fair. Gosh, mom. So, I think I'll plus two Ugin first to do three damage to that Jace. Okay. Temporal anomaly, young Jace is dead, but Actually, old Jace still lives. No, can't. Yeah. Okay. Um. Mm -hmm. And then I will attack with this manifest creature. <laughs> and then I'm going to pay seven mana. Can I hold on? Can I do this? Activate abilities. Yes. Okay. That works. Okay. Oh, no, wait. No, it doesn't work. Heck. <laughs> Heck. Uh, attack you for two. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, then I'll pay six mana to cast Scion of Ugin. Good old colorless. Four, four flyer. Yep. All right. Um, I believe that is everything that I can do. Cool. In Ugin's defense, 11 is still five short of casting Ugin twice in one turn to someone for six. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that is accurate. Uh, cool beans. Come on in. I'm gonna go ahead and some of our competitors. Cast Jason's erasure again. Up. Oh, yep. Excellent. Yep. Uh, so whenever I draw a card, top card of the library into your graveyard, uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and plus two to Jace. Mm -hmm. so, so we each both draw, draw a card, card, and then I mill one. You mill one. This is gonna be close. It's very close. I have Play land for the two card. cards left. <laughs> uh, and then I'm gonna go ahead and. 
Okay, one, two, three, four. Uh, control magic. On um, on that guy. Yep. Yeah, you've you've taken him. He is now mine. Uh. Well, yeah, that that'll be it. Okay. Pass turn. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Draw. Can I win this turn? Can I win this turn? Play Mountain. Alright, so I don't activate Hedron Archive. Okay. Because then I lose. <laughs> <laughs> solid plan, solid so, plan. Alright, let's, let's try this. I'm on board for this one. Pay five, um, cast Crux of Fate, destroy all dragon creatures. <laughs> it just kills that one thing. <laughs> Question for you. Yeah. How would that? Uh, wouldn't do much in this particular instance. Cool, awesome. Bye. Okay. <laughs> all right, then I will attack you for two. Beans, I take two. Okay. And then I will uptick Ugin mm -hmm. to do three damage to your face. My face. And then I will pay three mana to cast Ghost Fire at your face. No, no, <laughs> no. I do that damage too. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I lose because uh, I will run out of cards. Oh, cards. All, right. All right, game two. Game two. Woo! I had one chance. <laughs> one chance. You had one other option that was still super risky. You could have minus four to Ugin to wipe her board, but you still only have one card in your library. Yeah, yeah, it was uh, not not good. All right. Oh, <laughs> that was that was that was good. That was as close as I could have hoped for for throwing <laughs> these silly decks together. It's uh, spicy, as the youths do say. Oh. <laughs> Mill deck, though. Very scary. I've never played Because Ugin is just totally... <laughs> oh, I, sh I should have revealed... Oh, no, I didn't have to. It was a manifest, not a morph. Never yep. mind. <laughs> well, it was a manifest, and two, they changed that rule, so it's now not a game loss. <laughs> yeah, well... Yeet, Rachel, yeet. <laughs> According to, according to chat. What does that mean? The Lord hashtag, <laughs> hashtag bless Ye it. for distance, Kobe for accuracy. <laughs> <laughs> What's the thing we can't I have been in? told that multiple times. <laughs> <laughs> Yeet. Ooh. It's a fun word. It's, uh, it's just so classy there. Okay. That yeet. Ye <laughs> okay. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I'm out of the loop. Just right. doing random things. <laughs> there yep. you go. All right, good luck in good game luck. two here. Adam, shall you choose to play or draw? I will play first. Oh, really? Yes, Are please. You sure? Um. Okay. 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 <sighs> I have to mulligan. <laughs> You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for it. You gonna keep it? I'm gonna go All for right. It. Rachel's heart of the cards, and no, no, well, I'm probably playing this very, very dumb. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. That's largely That's right. the heart of the cards, and <laughs> oh, fair, fair. Okay, cool. Well, as long as we're Just on the same page with that. <laughs> believe in your top deck. <laughs> all right. Please don't fail me now. All right. So I get one, two, three, four, five, six. That over there, <laughs> and this is a this is a little better. Okay. Uh, three kroner islands are the most expensive basic land if you get the right ones. Um, bottom that. Get your three to four hundred dollar. Uh, what is it? Guru lands. I will oh, play yeah. unclaimed territory, naming dragon. Dragon. Pass turn. Play an island. Go figure. Uh, and Jace's Phantasm. Okay, 1-1. It's, one, one. it's a little 1-1 one, one right now. It um, is a 1-1 one, one flyer? Yeah, 1-1 one, one flyer. Um, 
but it gets plus four, plus four as long as an opponent has ten or more cards in his or her graveyard. Okay. I'll play uh, Crucible. You. I'm just going to put a storage counter on it right away because I've got nothing else to do. There. Henry, I do not understand that comment and I will not respond. <laughs> oh, but why? Um... Cool. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and swing at you for one. I will take one. Yeah. Ow. Pass First turn. blood. 500 points. Yes. Um, <laughs> play mountain. I, 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 enjoy, I enjoy the phrase Jacek Islands for the... Uh, Pass turn. <laughs> the uh, Ixalan Islands that all had Jace in them. I like that too. It's very nice. It's very nice. Uh, cool. Bahims. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh No yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That phantasm gonna get big quick. <laughs> uh, and then I'm gonna go ahead and submit you for one again. Alright. Uh play island. Hedron Archive. Yeah. Ugin's going to come out pretty quick this I hope screen. so. Pass turn. Uh, draw a card. Sphinx Actwix. Oh no. Chop two. Then You're not sure of color. Ghost fire. Still not red. Oh. <laughs> Fine. Uh, cool beans. Then we're just going to go ahead and... Cast Jace. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna go up to plus two. Plus each two. each, each person draws a card. card. And then I mill two and they do not share color. Cool. Um uh, and maybe I'll hit you hit you one. Okay. Pass turn. Not yet ten cards in Adam's graveyard, although it's gonna get there fast at this rate. Yeah, I have four cards. Oh, yes. So close. So close. Planes. <laughs> options. So many options. Six for Scion of Ugin. Ooh. Hey, buddy. He just looks like Ugin, but littler. <laughs> we baby Ugin. <laughs> Best turn. <laughs> cool. Uh, I'll keep, draw a card. Uh, Sphinx activates. Oh, yeah. Sure does. They don't share color. Cool. Uh, play a land for the turn. Buh. What do I want to do to your face? <laughs> so many bad things, it turns out. Apparently. I will remind our competitors, this is a PG stream. <laughs> yep. It is. Very much so. Keep it simple. Um, cool, yeah. I'm just going to go ahead and do... Uh, Something else terrible. <laughs> Something. Very much so. Talent of the Telepath. Okay. Target oh, opponent reveals the top seven cards of his or her library. You may cast an instant or sorcery card from among them without paying its mana cost. Then the player puts the rest into their graveyard. Nothing. Nothing. What the... There was one, wasn't there? Uh, there, there was, was but, it, but it was like... A fearsome awakening. But yeah. I, don't, I don't want that. I don't, I don't yeah, want and that. you don't have any creatures in your graveyard, do you? No, I don't. Yeah. So, wouldn't do much. Yeah. Uh, but now that little friendly fellow is a 4-4. A four, four. Excellent. Yeah. It's nice, Isn't right? 5-5 five, five now? Oh, plus five. four. Oh, plus, plus four. four. So it is a 5-5. Five, five. Oh. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> he's, he's big. He's big. <laughs> he's a chonk. All right. He, he, does, <laughs> he, he does chonk well. Uh, then we're going to go ahead and... Both draw a card. Plus J's, plus a card. And then I mill two, mill two, and they do not share a color. Cool. Um, pass turn. Untap. Draw for turn. Play a land. Tap eight. Cast Ugin. It's your boy. It's your boy, Ugin. Ugin. And I'm going to minus three Ugin. Minus three Ugin? Yes. Ooh. 
So he has four left. As all They're them. exiled, yes, Exiled, please. okay, cool. Forever, please, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you don't and then Scion of Ugin will uh, decide to attack your face. Cool. Very angrily. Uh, faster. <laughs> my daddy said. said. You'll hear from my father. <laughs> uh, okily dokily. Dragon Don't spirit. talk to me or my son. Something, something, something. Something, something, something. Dark side. <laughs> yes. Uh, cool beans. We're just going to go ahead and do a little Jace's archivus. Uh, I can pay... Windfall on a stick. Yep. Nice. Yep. Blue and tap. Each player discards her hand. Here's her hand. Uh, then draws equal to the greatest number of cards oh, a player discarded this way. That's dangerous. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else you'd like to do this turn? You've noticed the theme. <laughs> the theme. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Danger. Uh, and also, uh, just is Phantasm. Oh, just that guy. Just again. that guy again. And the kind of thing. And again, uh, five five now. Yeah. Yes, sir. And the cooldown counter relief, James. Come back to mama. Uh, draw for turn. <laughs> That's not disturbing. I will no, play no, a not. land. Uh, let's see. Creep is what I do best. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to pay three right away. I'm going to ghost fire the archivist. Uh, is it archivist or archivist? Ar yes. Yeah. Yeah, words. And then I'm going to minus one Ugin, exiling... Wait, what was he at? We are not linguistic prescriptions here. He was at four. He was at four. And then so minus three... Why is it the three right next to it? These aren't spin down six Why? Yeah, I'm guessing exile is. Exiled, yes, cool. please. <laughs> um. <laughs> All right. Uh, dragon mana, dragon mana, something, something. <laughs> Thunderbreak regent, and then a white, and then something else with the uh, Ugin on the mastery of the unseen. Cool. And then attack for four, please. All right. And then I shall pass the turn. You sure? Pause. We should have this cooldown mechanic uh, for a real format people can build in, but have it be any spell. Oh, no. I don't know about that. Oh, that's, that's some... That's that sounds, that, that sounds like combo. That's some wacky magic times there. Yep. Uh... I like cooldown for commandery type stuff more than commander tax, just because like JC could cast a couple of times after he dies with commander tax. Ugin starts to get a little tricky. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, cool. We'll just go ahead and do that and, and cast control mage sure. on, your, on your little, little buddy. Uh, and then you take three damage. Yep. Because, yep. It's because dragons. And we still tap, correct? Yep. Yep. Just dragon things. Just dragon things. Yeah, that's all I got. Yes. Untap. Draw for turn. Uh, the cooldown mechanic. Mm. Instead of commander tax when your uh, planeswalker dies, uh, they get one cooldown counter for each time they have died. At the end of your next turn, the cooldown counters tick down by one. You cannot cast a planeswalker if it still has a cooldown counter on it. For the purposes of this, the most counters a Planeswalker can get is three. So even if they die four, five, or six times, they still get three cooldown counters. All right. Uh, attack for four. I take four. Okay. And then I will take up Ugin. So you mm -hmm. take three more, please. <laughs> That's all you got? Not quite. No, oh, fair. Fair, fair, <laughs> fair. <laughs> Uh, let's see what we want to do. We'll do this one. It is more flavor. Ugh. More flavor. More flavor. All right, and yeah. Um, oh, I have tapped my mana poorly. It is fine. Pass turn. <laughs> Everything's fine. Nothing's on fire. Everything's fine. <laughs> All right, Jason, a bit of a tough spot here. Yeah. I believe in you, Rachel. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. <laughs> um. Commander tax works well for commander. I just wanted the cooldown mechanics so the planeswalkers keep coming out since that's kind of the point of the stream. Mm-hmm. Uh, I 
think you got me on this one. Yep. All right. I got nothing. All right. Game of the third. Let's game of the third. The, let's go to the next one. Oh, wait. Wait. Oh, did yeah. you have something? Oh. Just you, had my, you had my scion. <laughs> uh, we do know who is piloting the other two decks, and you will know that once the match starts. Things how if I just say two names, uh, you might know who they are, but half the rest of the stream wouldn't. Oh, it's I old Bob! Bob down the road! <laughs> Bob, Bob from accounting. Bob from accounting. <laughs> I believe you have his stapler? <laughs> Can you tell us in a way that only we would know? Yes, but I refuse to. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but no. <laughs> what is this, a mystery hour? <laughs> uh, can you tell me in a way that only I would know? They, they are two people who work in the same building as you. That narrows it down to only about 300 people now. <laughs> yeah, oh jeez. Only. There are a lot of people. There's so many people around. That's good, though. I know. It's yeah. only a vague exaggeration. <laughs> <laughs> all Turns right. out, all y'all out there keep ordering enough magic cards from us that we keep having to hire more people to fill the orders. It's a good problem to have. All right. I will keep... No? No? I'm gonna hire the cards like I did last year. No, no, no. <laughs> I, don't, I don't believe in this deck that much. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Oh. Harsh. Well, Harsh. I mean, considering the mana I had, it just wasn't, it was not a feasible thing. And like the cards in my hand versus the mana that I had in my hand was not. Not, not having it. It wasn't gonna work. Mm. All right. Yeah, building a five color plus colorless deck, uh, the man is weird. <laughs> Just it's a little, little weird. A little strange. A little odd. A little out there. That's uh, that's fine. It's <laughs> 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 uh, gonna leave. Leave. Mm, no, that goes in the bottom. Okay. Okay. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Nothing's on fire. All right, Rachel, lead us off. Cool. Uh, island. Mm. Pass. Henry, stop making Yu-Gi-Oh references. I don't actually know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh. I, I will name the type dragon. Dragons. Mm -hmm. Sure, Surprise. not like snakes or no, just just dragons. Goblins. Not They're like uh, no snakes with wings and arms and legs. Oh, fair enough. I think that's just Trogdor. <laughs> <laughs> I said consummate. <laughs> My turn. Go. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Island. We'll go ahead and pass. Not suspicious at all through nope. blue deck. Nope, definitely mm -hmm. not. Can't do anything, I, I guess. I just... Um... Uh, pay two. I will discard a forest with Tormenting Voice. Is that okay? Go for it. All right, and I will draw two cards. Pass turn. Okay. Yes, I know I mentioned believing in the heart of the cards. That is literally the extent of my Yu-Gi-Oh knowledge. <laughs> That's a lie. I know Blue Eyes White Dragon. There, I've done it. Blue Eyes White Dragon. <laughs> um. Yeah, best turn. Definitely suspicious. Trap cards are a thing. You can assemble that one monster dude to win. Um, <laughs> Island, go. <laughs> oh, no. This is... I do not know the context this for is, it, Henry. This is, just this is powerful magic right here. Right, right here, exactly, exactly. Um, cool. Well, I will do Shumption, uh, Jace's Sanctum. Yeah, okay. Instant sorcery spells uh, cost one less cast. Whenever you cast an instant sorcery, subscribe one. Excellent. Yes. Okay, I will play a swamp. Yeah. Pass turn. Yeah, that sweet, sweet swamp. Getting there. Yep. You just wait in like three more turns. I'm gonna do something. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> um. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cast Jace. Just get him out here. Yar. Yarp. Uh, like one of these. 
There you I go. would. I would like one of those. Thank you. You know what? We'll just both draw a card. Oh, thanks. Before we are friends. I needed one of those. Ooh, that's a good one, too. Yeah. <laughs> Dang it! <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Jace. I do not take it back, for we are friends. <laughs> <laughs> uh, past turn. Unclaimed territory. Mm. And I will play. Guess what? It's a dragon. I named dragon for that. I know I didn't say it, but you knew it. <laughs> Herbinger of the Hunt. Herbingers? Herbingers! <laughs> He's binging some horror. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Don't think that's what that means. <laughs> <laughs> you know me! <laughs> Uh, does that do it? Does that does that? Uh, before you're in the turn, okay. why not? Why not? Uh, Perilous voyage. Or just put them. Put them back in your hand. Okay. Back in your hand, he goes, and then there I. Goes. Uh, you do nothing do except nothing. you scry one for this thing. For that thing, yep. But you don't scry one for that thing. I do not scry one. Oh, and that's it yeah, only it's cast. One less. <laughs> Even better. <laughs> It's like Googling har, but for Microsoft fanboys. <laughs> <laughs> what? Harbinging. Har- har- Harbinging. Don't. Th- thumbs down Don't. from the peanut Don't. calorie over nope. there. Nope. All right. I'm going down. Henry, the crowd didn't didn't go for it. Sorry. <laughs> Don't like it. Don't like it. None. Uh, cool beans. Three. Now that there's a Hearthstone card okay. called Ursatron, yep. our Hearthstone and MTG in the same universe. Right. No! Is there, is there more? I'm sorry. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and... Yeah, we'll go Ooh, ahead. Ooh, thank you. Again, oh, that's exactly off. what I needed. <laughs> I think you're lying to my face. Nope. <laughs> See, chat knows. <laughs> Boo. Boo earns. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Master. All right. Um, uh, play land. Okay. I, I almost got the full domain. Uh, yeah. So, the thing that I needed is an awkward mana cost, which is nice. Aww. <laughs> Five and a half. Mm. <laughs> Are we playing? Are we playing with uncards now? <laughs> I'm gonna do something. It's my format. I can do, do whatever I want. I'm gonna do something. Oh, what do I want to do though? I can't do that and that, and I can only do that. I think I just have to do this. <laughs> Listen, it's hard. This game is hard sometimes. Okay. Words are hard. Uh, ghost fire on an archivist. Uh. Had to try. It's colorless, in case you're wondering. <laughs> no. Just no. Just no. Yeah. Which Dis- spell? Dispel. We did it. <laughs> Which spell? <laughs> Dispel. <laughs> yes. Nice. Nice. I'm not even mad. I mean, I'm a little, I'm a little upset, but I'm not mad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do the thing. Do the this thing. Oh yeah. Thank oh, yeah, you. you got a Thank you, chat and and Chris and <laughs> things and whatnot. Mm-hmm. We're playing friendly here. We're playing friendly because because sir, we are friends. Mm, we are friends. Yes. All right, cool. Do that. All right, now. Oh boy. Island. Uh. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do this. Are we archiving? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Are we getting archival? Mm -hmm. Something's happening. Yeah, we're gonna go. We're going to have a cribal. Yep. Oh boy. So we discard our hands. Yep. One, and two, then three, four. Draw. I have seven cards. So we draw up to seven. Five, six, seven. The alternate way to mill your opponent is just to have them actually draw all the cards out of their library. <laughs> Seems to work. How many cards do you have in your graveyard? Oh, ten. ten? About <laughs> ten. About ten? Right about ten. ten. It's exactly ten. Exactly ten? <laughs> According to my math, oh, it's happy exactly day. 10. Chase's phantasm. He is in chonk mode. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
Uh, yeah, and then I'm going to go ahead and plus Jace again. Yeah, that's true. Swamp. I think Sweet. that's right. Might be wrong, but it's just happened. It already happened. All right. So four. It's a number between Shaman and also Thunderbaker. Yeah. Blue players. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I guess. Cool. Um, and I do not need that ever happening again. So ghost fire, please. Ghost fire. <laughs> <laughs> You've been caught in the... <laughs> turn. Cool. Um, well. Uh, did I play land for this turn? Not yet. Nope. Not yet. Thank you. Uh, sorry, not sorry. Okay. Jesus, our covers. <laughs> sure. <laughs> yep. Sure. It was uh, just that first one I didn't like. That one. Oh, that that just, just that, that one. Yeah, that's specifically. Okay, that cool. One. Yeah. It's Greg. He's, Greg. he's <laughs> awful. He's just awful. What a jerk. <laughs> he is a jerk. Yeah. Um. Cool beans. We'll go ahead and plus Jay's one more time. And pass right. I mean, I got, I gotta try. Ugin. Eugene. Yeah, I'll allow it. <sighs> okay. Just when I think I'm down. All right. <laughs> so that costs four. That costs three. That costs three. That costs one. This costs four. So we'll say minus three. Minus three. Minus three. Okay. Everything but the two. Actually, wait. Mid. Hold. Okay. Hold. Hold. Okay. Hold. Holding. Holding. Hold. Holding. Holding. Uh, before everything goes, mm -hmm. so I want to four. I'm gonna cast Jesus Ingenuity, drawing three cards. Oh sure. And you do get to scry one. I do get to scry one. Bottom and would this still be on the stack? <laughs> I'm just asking judge rules. Uh, the ingenuity? No. No, no, no. Uh, that was a planeswalker activation, not a spell. That's oh, that's right. Because so you already got you already got cool. Yeah. Awesome. Then uh, that is all I need. Then it, then it happens. And okay. then it happens. And they are exiled. And I don't know. If, I don't know if it matters. Actually, that, that has so many seconds yeah, as well. He, he was new. You can't have Yep. Meow. 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 Jace. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Just in time. You, you don't have, have to discard, discard yet. Until the end of your turn. Yeah. You still have some time. Does that change, or have I just been doing this wrong this whole entire time? That one. Okay. That one. Okay. That one. I like that uh, one. I will, yes. I will attack for four. Uh, cool. I'll take four. Pass turn. To my face. Hand size only counts at the end of your turn. Oh. Good to know. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Said nothing. Said nothing. Um. Yeah, faster. Um, and then that goes away. Draw, and then I do it. First things first, we will do a plus two on Eugene. Mm -hmm. It's three damage to you. And then I will attack you for four. And then I will pay six mana for six. Cyan of Ugin. Uh, no. Counters he has been counterspelled. Oh, and I... And you scry one? Scry. 
Man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 I concur. Mm-hmm. Very much mm-hmm. so. Cool. Do that. Card for the turn. One, Chase. Oh, I don't get more cards. No, no, you don't. All right. No, 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 no. <laughs> but I need. I only have six. <laughs> <laughs> only, only. Well, that's that's sad for you. Uh, anyway, faster. All right. Uh, end of your turn. Yes. I will sacrifice Haven of the Spirit Dragon to get uh, Dr- Dragon Lord Jamoka into my hand. Jamoka. I forgot that card does that. <laughs> <laughs> Draw off a turn. Knew I put it in the deck for some reason. (laughs) Ah, yes, that. And then... I will pay... Let me me check my situation here. Yeah, I think that's that's what's happening. Um, Again, Adam, PG stream. No checking situations here. I I mean... uh, (laughs) (laughs) I will cast Dragon Lord Dramoka. Um, and then I will minus three Uga. He still hilarious two. with two counters. Okay. Phantasm is dead. Your Phantasm is mm-hmm. yeah, that's ex- right. exiled. Ex- ex-filed. And then attack for four. With flying, if that matters. Frying? That's right. Okay. See the cogs turning. Yep. <laughs> Trying to see if I can make this work. Um, cool. I'm going to go ahead and... Cast... Uh... Yeah, you got me. Grr! Oh. Grr! Sad Jace is sad. Boo earns. Boo earns, yep. All right. Well, it was a good, valiant effort and a good match. Good match. Huzzah! And with that, Ugin moves on. Uh, we are now going to take a moment to reset. Look at our bracket here. Uh, Nicobolus versus Liliana is about to occur. You all can choose whichever side you want. And we will be back with that match in just a second. Huzzah! Hello, everybody. We are back. Uh, you two, Scooty and the camera can't actually see you. We are here with our Nicol Bolas versus Liliana match. Simon over here will be piloting the Nicol Bolas deck. Mm-hmm. David here will be piloting Liliana. How are you two on this fine day? Uh, suitably maniacal for, <laughs> for what I'm playing here. Uh, I miss my Manscara, but, you know, next time. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I, I did want to check before we get started. Uh, if the match goes badly for me, I have the ability to make him disintegrate like in that War of the Spark trailer, right? <laughs> uh, we never saw if she actually dies. I mean, I feel like having that ability would at least maybe get me through a couple rough turns. So I, just wanted, to, I wanted to confirm whether or not that feature had been added to the stream or not. Not quite yet. All right, fair enough. I think it might be a bit of a stretch on a PG family stream mm. if we... Viscerally destroy one of our employees. Well, <laughs> David no longer works for the same team as me, so that's true. <laughs> yeah. David is an upstairs trader. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so uh, all right, how are we starting this off? Uh, rolled see who goes first. Excellent. Yeah. I'll take the play. <laughs> and just so you all know, since you weren't right here for this part, uh, we can see to about the back of this thing. Okay. And then just past where David has Liliana. 
as right. far as like where you keep your cards. Put command zone sort of spot right there. Fascinating. Okay. This is bad. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. Off to I'll, a great I'll, start. We'll, we'll just. There we go. Do, do we want to do the gentleman's draw and just go back up oh, to seven? Yes. Gentlemen, gentlemen. No, nope, no. Nope. Game one is a draw. <laughs> Game two. <laughs> I have done that in one actual magic tournament that wasn't like an FNM. I talked to my opponent at a old school PTQ. <laughs> for us to just keep mulling to seven in game one and just report that many draws. So we actually ended up reporting a match result of two, one, and six. <laughs> oh, Lord. Uh, this is this is better. <laughs> this is not. <laughs> well, I, I will take my my real mulligan now, if that's all right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. This is a little little bit of an unorthodox style of of deck for me to play. I, I guess, <laughs> it has more colors than red. Yes, and as, possibly as black. People who know me, uh, I I am definitely the aggro in most matchups, but. Uh, I, I like this particular list. It's very, very tasty. Okay. Yeah, I'll keep this. Yeah, once well, again, th these decks were built to be semi-powerful, but mostly thematic. So, yeah. All right, have you resolved mulligans? Have you scried and all yep. your shenanigans? All right. Oh, good. Uh, we're going to start with a tapped fetid pools. Mm. And we're going to pass the turn to you. Well, I don't know what's in your uh, hand, but we're about to find out. The rest. All right. So... Those are the three you can take. Two lands and a My Claw Shaman. Okay. So we have a Gem of Becoming, a Blightning, and Dark Intimations. Yes. The hmm. card that everybody was like, why does this exist? <laughs> well, I just love the window of time when that card was previewed where people are like, well, there's a bolus coming. What if this card makes it broken? Not a worry, friends. <laughs> Didn't happen. Well, I think I'm going to go for the Blight. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, all you. All right. Some all of the Nickel Bolas cards are slightly off theme, but are all from Conflux. So like, Blightning isn't technically a Nickel Bolas card, but mm -hmm. it is a Grixis card. Yeah. Um, we are going to play a Canyon Slough tapped. Pass the turn. Not exactly, not exactly going to run you over with this deck, but there's some powerful late game. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm afraid of. <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, we talked a little bit. I know Lily Duck can run people over. That's if true. It gets but the right draw. I don't like that my run over can be immediately stolen by <laughs> <players. laughs> So uh, your go. All right. I will say I did not set up the bracket, so I did not like choose which side ended up where. Sulfur Falls comes into play untapped. Uh, let's see how we want to do this. Sorry, I'll try and fix that thing with Simon's name. Why that What way? have you done to my name? Your name is appearing in a strange manner on the stream. I'm choosing to take this deeply personally. Bolas forgets nothing. <laughs> uh, we're going we're gonna to throw down this gem of becoming. Uh, very weird little card. Uh, the previous matches were determined. Oh, so, uh, we had the Spark Madness thing going for a couple of weeks on Hipsters of the Coast. Uh, they put up a thousand leagues uh, draft league for us, essentially, our bracket league. Uh, and, what was I trying to say? Just oh, yeah, bring need to Liliana update right our board out. Absolutely. Live. And we'll just plus one that immediately. All right. Over 1,800 people. So each player's going to discard a card. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna get rid of swamp. Feel like I got plenty oh, of those. Oh, we're not doing the we're not doing the thing where you do oh, the where stuff. it's all secret. Yeah, yeah. Uh, oh. I'm getting rid of a a different card. <laughs> let's just move this around <laughs> in my hand. Amazing. There we go. Oh, uh, let's see. How do I want to do this here? Um, we're gonna we're gonna discard that one. It's a mind clash on there. Okay. <laughs> all right. Anything else for you? Nope. All, right. all you. Anyway, yes, over 1,800 people uh, submitted brackets for this, and from that, uh, we just crunched the numbers, figured out who the most common Final Fours were, and yeah, that was that. Uh, Judge, quick question. Yes. I'm assuming that this card still only says player. Uh, yes. The new t thank you very much. I appreciate that. Um, 
I am. Well, y'all, Cardboard Live is working to get uh, updated. I'm going to pass the turn to you, David. Ooh, I do like that. It's having, it's having, <laughs> it's having a moment here. I'll start dividing my lands into Grixis piles. Yeah. No. We'll start dividing more of those later. Um, I'm going to play a swamp, and we're just going <laughs> to tick this up All right. once more. So I have a response to that. Um, we are going to tap three uh, to sacrifice the gem of becoming in response there to the Landswalker trigger. Okay. Um, and I am going to go and get some stuff. Of course, the cool thing about this is that it's just island, swamp, or mountain. They don't have to be basics. Yep. So... This deck has uh, a lot of cycling lands. I was waffling on putting Gem of Becoming into the deck until I read that there is no basic in there, and it's like, okay, this is much better. Yeah. <laughs> is good. Uh, let's see here. I'm already quite set on my colors, honestly. <laughs> I have so. so much good mana. What do I do? Oh, no. <laughs> no. It's so tough. Uh, for the sake of and, uh, just simplicity and... Here. Things coming into play untapped. Is there no? Okay, there we go. There we uh, go. We're grabbing one of everything. Um, and if you'd like to do that. Oh, no. Yes, let's just. There we go. And then I'm going to discard that mountain to the ability. Okay. I'm discarding another uh -huh. stone. Go, go. I know. Everyone, edge of their seats for that. But. All right. Um, you go. All right. Do, 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 do. All right, to that island that you've seen. I like the semifinals are Planeswalkers in control of Udnid armies this match, and then the nerds associated with them All right. the previous match. The dark intimations are happening. All right. uh, you sacrifice a creature or a Planeswalker, and then you discard a card, and I can return a creature or Planeswalker from my graveyard to my hand, and then I draw a card. Okay, well, hard decision. Yep. But... So Lily dies with one cooldown counter All on right. it. You discard so... a card. Uh, another swamp. Yay. Uh, I'm going to get this Mind Claw Shaman back. And then I'm going to draw a card. Do those tick down at the end of At the end of turn? your next turn. End of my next so turn. So you have to wait one through one full turn, and then it goes away, and then you can cast the spell. All right. But that's going to be it for me. Pass back to you, David. Okay. Uh, let's go with a swamp. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> We're doing it, guys. We're going to get there. Anything else for you, David? No. No. All right. <laughs> Untap. Upkeep. Draw. Anyone remember the Hour of Devastation preview stream with the giant maniacal nickel bolus? It was quite fun. <laughs> Let's see here. All right, so we're going to throw down another Sulphur Falls. Um, we're going to do that. And that. And that. Lots of mana up. Uh, we're going to get you Blightninged. Three to you. Uh -huh. Discard two cards. That's, that's all of my things. Yes! How but I'm the discard were, deck. How many of them were swamps? Uh, none. <laughs> no, you fool. This Delightful. is me. Uh, that's going to be all for me. All right. Now we're playing my favorite kind of game. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's just... Uh, Lily's back. Back again. This is a bad decision, actually. Lily's great. <laughs> um, Tell a friend. <laughs> I don't like that you have a million cards and I have the one. Uh, it's almost like a nickel bowl. Schemes yeah. within schemes within schemes. Uh, you know, I hate to say it, but I wish I had one more swamp. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, let's... Yeah, let's just pass. Oh, all yeah. right. Okay. So... Find your refusal to do things... Kind of horrifying. Um, I mean, we're here to cast Planeswalkers, right? Mm. <laughs> so, Nick comes down, uh, and for the first time in the history of magic, Dark Intimations will trigger. <laughs> uh, Alright, when you cast it, you exile it, and they enter with an additional loyalty. So we start on six. Ooh. So that's kind of fun. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Nothing that's to take! That's cool. <laughs> Uh, and I guess we're going to tick up and uh, blow up one of your lands. Oh. You, said, you said you needed one more swamp, and you've shown your weakness. Yeah. So That is a plus three. Oh, man. Ooh, this is not going to go well All for All right, me. go ahead, David. Yeah, Nicobolus is kind of gross once he gets going. Look, I'm solving my problem. Swamp. <laughs> it's a net. Yeah. Uh, 
has just still not a whole lot of points. Mm, okay, let's pass. All right. Untap, upkeep, draw. All right, I'm gonna play Swamp. Um, I am going to Nickel Bolus. What is it? Uh, we're gonna we're gonna wait a little bit for that. Uh, we're gonna destroy a non-creature permanent. Yep. It's gonna be all the swamps. I have cards in my hand that that don't do a lot. Oh no. Um, <laughs> let's see. We're gonna tap five, and we're gonna play a Mind Claw Shaman. Uh, I would like you to reveal your hand, and if there's an instant sorcery, I can cast it without paying its mana cost. There's not. There's it's a demon, a demon lord Belzenlock. Yeah. Uh, rad. Okay, well, I <laughs> won't be casting anything. Ah, join me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and then uh, I'm going to pass to you. Cool. Unfortunately, you have given me something to do, finally. Liliana. Yep. Minus two. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Nerd. <laughs> Take that. Claw my way back up. All right, you're go. All right, all right. I think the goal here is to kill you with this <laughs> ultimate. You you have distilled magic. Yep. <laughs> no, no. Specifically, we're we're going for we're going for the style points now. Uh, we're gonna oh, blow up Liliana. Yep. There we go. Um, so two, there's two of them now. Uh, we're gonna tap two. And we're gonna put an auger bolus into play. Uh, let's look at the top three, shall we? Oof, that's a that's a swing and a miss a right whiff. there. Put them all on the bottom. Uh, the good news is that we're gonna do it again. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, we're gonna put a terminate into my hand. It's some demon lord bells and lock insurance. Mm -hmm. um, and I promise, one of these days we'll find a way to kill you. Go ahead. All right. Got a. Just inordinate number of swamps in a row. Uh, but let's go for this. Make it interesting. Demon Lord uh, of We're going to soul manipulation that. Oh, I don't like that. So I counter target creature spell, and I also return a creature card from my graveyard to my hand. So my Mind Claw Shaman is coming back. Go. <laughs> yeah. That, that's countered. It's not back in your hand. Uh, but, but I want stuff. <laughs> judge. Judge. <laughs> my opponent's shenanigans. All right. Let's see here. Um, well, <laughs> all right, let's see, you sacrifice seven permanents, huh? Oh. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna, we're just gonna cash in on that. We're gonna nickel bolus ultimate. You take seven, discard seven cards, and sacrifice seven permanents. <laughs> well, I don't have to discard seven cards, so there's that. Cool. Uh, and you do take seven damage. <laughs> This is going well. Simon, the amount of glee in your voice right now. <laughs> oh, no. I, mean, I mean, we're in character right now. Make no <laughs> mistake. Uh, well, I'm going to attack with two augers of bolus into my opponent who has none permanence. Nope. Um, we are going to play a creature because warm bodies are Ha! Ah, nothing in hand. Um, Solving my problems. And I'm also going to throw out another gem of becoming. Mm. Pass to you, David. <laughs> hey, guys, guess what? Swamp. <laughs> Hey, you might uh, want to shuffle real good next time. <laughs> I've spent like 10 minutes shuffling. <laughs> uh, anything else, David? Uh, no, I'm okay. <laughs> I feel you guys are reenacting the trailer should, right should now. I, yeah, should, should I just like... Uh, yeah, we're going to blow that. Yeah. A swamp up. Uh, that, we're going to attack you for uh, four. Lily was making headway in the trailer. <laughs> yeah. Let's see here. So I don't think they ever got across swamp. the bridge, and I'm... Uh, I think, let's see. Uh, all right, so we're going to Torment of Hellfire you for seven. Okay. <laughs> Just. Yeah. <laughs> don't have a whole lot of other options. So Simon drew all his good cards. <laughs> David drew all of his swamps. Yeah. I think I think we would all agree that the MVP of that game was uh, Dark Intimations. <laughs> <laughs> I literally used every clause on that card. <laughs> That's very impressive. God, I don't. Mm. Yeah. All right. So, so right. my my fear is that that was that was like the first part of the trailer, but then like whatever comes next, that you know the, the the slow roll magic story that they've got going for us over the next month is going to come up here. It's going to end badly. I, I, I don't know. Uh, let's hope so. Yes. <laughs> oh, look at this card they just spoiled. Lily's horrible death. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Yes. <laughs> I'm just imagining 
Bolas actually just winning. Yeah, just just, just straight yeah. up. Yeah, just just like like all all thirty six other planeswalkers who have been in the set. Turns out that they all die. Yeah. Nicol Bolas rules over everything. Everyone snapped. Nico the, Bolas rules. The the, re the rest of the set is just eternalized versions of all your favorite planeswalkers. And That'd be pretty right, got their Fool's Gold package. Very nice and awesome. Tokens, what did you get, Azure Shock? Fool's Gold is always the fun stuff. Anyway. <laughs> it's always fun. Uh, we were talking earlier before y'all got here, and I think before we started the stream, that we all want Garrick to show up and just be the secret winner of the This is part. awesome! <laughs> <laughs> Murder! <laughs> <laughs> While like singing tiptoe through the tulips or something. <laughs> he would. Mm -hmm. All right, all right, all right. I think we're we're, we're nice and shuffly. Uh, I'm assuming you're gonna take the play. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's try that. All right. War of the Spark is secretly Transformers the movie. They're just killing off all their old IPs so they can sell more new stuff. <laughs> Fibble Fit becomes Eric's right. sidekick. I would watch that show. <laughs> yes. All right. Uh, yeah, let's give this a shot. Yeah, we're also good here. Okay. So I'll go. Okay. Uh, we're going to start with a canyon slew and pass the turn. So I'll go. All right. <laughs> I swear I have more than swamp. Power to gaming. I know there's things for that deck to do. <laughs> uh, Drown Catacomb is going to come down, uh, and we are going to play an early auger bolus. All good? Okay. All right, so I gotta do my thing. Uh, swing and a miss. Oh yeah, Augur Bull's batting average not great. Cards in hit. Uh, six. Six. For uh, now. <laughs> <laughs> Swamp. I swear, something's coming. Let's try playing a creature now. Uh, a risen Gorgon. As death touch as long as I have Liliana. Can I? May, may oh, I? Oh yeah, yeah, absolutely. <sighs> Dem planeswalker death cards. Yeah. Right, that's a th three, 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 three. Turns out are actually not so, bad yeah, in not actual Planeswalker decks. Yeah, go figure. All right. Uh, anything else for you? Uh, no. All Tybalt yours. learns empathy and ends up adopting hundreds of strays across a dozen planes. <laughs> I, I, I ship it. All right, let's see here. Uh, we're going to go for a Sulphur Falls. And we are going to cast Blightning. So three to you. Nope. Oh, uh oh. Reset life total. Just there. We go. There we go. And also, please discard two. Okay. Um. Gonna go for a killing wave and mind rot. Hmm. Those are all horrifying names for cards. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that's gonna be it. Pass to you. Swamp. Uh, let's see. Swing him. Swing him. Uh, let's just pop out Liliana mm -hmm. real quick. Oh, hey, and minus two. And swing for third. Right. There we go. I did something now. Dumb. All right. Well, uh, your go. Unfortunately, right. he attempts to pet a Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let's see here. Uh, we're going to play a Drown Catacomb. And we are going to play another Rocker Bullis. Okay. Let's see if we can find some cards. Nope. Nope. Lots of nope. <laughs> um, uh, we're going to pass to you. All right. Let's um, sell the score. Uh, Augur Bulls. So I'm going to uh, Ooh, that's like exile cool. the Augur and tick this up by two. Um, I may have a response to this. I will not do that. Um... Let's see here. Yeah. Um, we are going to play a very weird card that I only just learned existed. It's called Imp's Mischief. Uh, so I get to change the target of target spell with a single target. Mm. I lose life equal to that spell's converted mana cost. So you're going to settle a score with your own Gorgon. Oh. But I will lose four. Time takes four. Lily still takes up two. Yeah. All right. Uh... Let's just get rid of that auger real quick. There we go. <laughs> All right, you go. Efficient. All right, let's see here. We're going to play a Drown Catacomb. 
and for chat, Imp's Mischief is also printed in a Johnny versus Nicol Bolas. So really? It, uh, read the flavor text. I mean, I, it's Nicol Bolas. I mean, I see that, but this card, this huh. was from Planner Chaos. Yeah. 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 It, it's yeah. it's still got flavor text there. Yep. Um. All right. Well, this is happening. Go ahead. All right. Uh. Tom. Yep. And let's. Uh, how many cards you got in hand? Three. Let's fix that. Uh, <laughs> Rubey discard a card. Mm -hmm. All right. Slave of Bolas. Settle the score. Um, let's then mine rot. Choose another two. Mm. All right. We're doing this. Okay. Yes. Uh, terminate and swamp go away. All right. Feel a little bit better about this game. All right. Uh, your go. Okay. Ooh. Interesting. Um. Ooh, this is the most strategic choice I've had to make in this match so far. Um, we're just gonna play a land tapped. Go ahead. All right. I feel like if I draw, if if I cycle it, and I can't play the card, I just lose it to Liliana, and I don't like that. Let's see. That's fair. Swamp and. I think I'm just gonna tick this up because I think I got a way of getting back. All right. Oh, discard my crystal brain. All right. All right. Go. That's not bad at all. Um, that'll be the Eldest Reborn. Each opponent sacrifices a creature or planeswalker. Ah. Rad. Yeah. Um, pass to you. Somewhere two in there. Discards a card. Uh, I sure love that Grizzle Brand is in your graveyard right now. <laughs> mm, I don't. <laughs> uh, Undead Servant. Uh, right. When it enters, I get a 2-2 two -two zombie for each copy of that in oh, there. Oh, cool. There are none. All right. So I will just take that. All right. Untap. Draw a card. Uh, we do this. Uh, so you each opponent discards a card. Yay. Um, I'm going to play a Swamp. And then Nick's coming in. There is a couple of copies of at least one card that David really wants to draw this next turn. Yes. Uh, <laughs> all right. So we are going to destroy that. Fair. Even though I sort of don't want them in the graveyard. Go ahead. New plan. Stealing the ah, <laughs> undead servant. We are back to this game. Ah. So, boo earns. Uh, hmm. Do I want to just sit here and sack Lily on each turn? Yeah, why not? <laughs> uh, I'll just tick her up. All right. I have no cards in hand. Uh, untap, upkeep, draw. Sagas. All right, Eldest Reborn cracks. Um, would as you like the Undead Servant? Tempted as I am to get the Undead Servant, uh, I would love that Grizzle Brand, please. Yeah, there. Hey, buddy. Oh, I don't like this. Oh, hey, buddy. Um, all right, let's see here. Good news, you can only activate it once. <laughs> Um, we are going to tick Nickel Bolas up and destroy Liliana. Okay. Um, That's not how that works. And then we're going to tap this. And we're going to Torment of Hellfire you for five. So you lose three life unless you sacrifice a non-land permanent or discard a card five times. Ah, non-land permanent, huh? Yeah. Let's just get down to two real yeah. quick. Yeah. Well, that's gross. Yeah. Yep. Uh, go. I feel like this is. <laughs> uh, cards in hand? None. Well, that's kind of what I thought. Yeah. Um. Boorns. Go. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. All right. Um, I'm gonna attack with Grizzlebrand. I'm just gonna. Die. Die. Oh, let's go. There we go. <laughs> All right, David. <laughs> Boo earns. Well, fun. No. Ridiculous. Liliana did not quite draw the cards. She needed it in the right order. And thus, Nicol Bolas was victorious. Dragon match. Brother Vengeance match. So we do indeed have a rematch of a storyline fight, which will be coming up in just a moment. Uh, we'll go back to our bracket. Intro music. And we'll be back in a second. Alright, we are getting set here for our Dragon Grudge match. Yes! Let me make sure things are set correctly on the stream. 
There we go. Dragon Date. Grudge match. All right. Uh, how y'all feeling? How's it going? <sighs> <laughs> I feel great, Chris. I just I just watched that and that I'm I'm a little nervous, if we're uh, being honest. <laughs> Ugin has a pretty good Nicol Bolas matchup, like just as far as the Planeswalker cards go. Mm-hmm. You can like he doesn't really have ramp. You actually have Hedron archives and things to get Nicol Bol- or to get Ugin out faster. Well, we'll see. Yeah. All right. The fact uh, that Nicol Bolas can just blow up Ugin is a little much. It's it's not optimal. All right. <laughs> High roll? Sure. Alright. I'll, I'll do it. Bodes well. Schemes within schemes here. All according to Bullis's plan. Sure. <laughs> uh, Acer Shock, that is indeed an Acer Predator for the streaming laptop we are using. Oh, that is not at all any good. <laughs> Just, uh, this is similarly kind of questionable. Gentleman's Dragon? <laughs> yeah, no, I'll, I'll offer it. Yeah? Right. Gentlemen. Sir. All right, it's a draw. Everybody wins. <laughs> Respected <laughs> colleague. Brother. <laughs> Brother, why do we fight? It's because I hate you so much. <laughs> so much. <laughs> right. Oh, well, that's, I mean, fair. <laughs> oh, we're, 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 we're leaning into the role here. Let's be clear. Good okay. old brother slap fight. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep. This is medium, but... Several well, thousand-year-old brothers well who keep. have... One is a ghost. Yes, <laughs> All right, crumbling Necropolis pass. Looking at the brackets, I only saw one or two upsets. Uh, yeah, uh, I was I'm kind of surprised. Tormenting mm-hmm. voice. What are you discarding? Uh, Master of the Unseen. Gotcha. Tybalt made it as far as he did, which is winning one awesome. round. Oh, Tybalt. I should update the... Uh, the T- name here. Tibble is a very dapper, dapper gentleman. Um, I'm going to play a tapped Sulphur Falls and pass the turn to you. There we go. <sighs> Top deck. <laughs> Noise. Get those planes. Um, there are a whole two of them in the deck. Yeah, that's why I got rid of that Master of the Unseen. I did not expect to see one of those planes. Uh, I'm going to Tormenting Voice, tossing out Sign of Ugin. Gotcha. How are the winners of the bracket prior to the final four determined? Uh, yes, sir. A bunch of people submitted their brackets. They, they filled out brackets, just like you would for like the NCAA Final Four. Submitted them to Hipsters of the Coast. We got the data from the Tapped over 1,800 people who submitted those brackets and averaged out the results at each match. So those are the most common winners given the Direct results out. that people submitted. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's fine. That's a lot of mana. All right. So far, uh, this is actually following what was supposed to happen according to the brackets if we boiled it down all the way to the winner since the finals match ended up being Nicol Bolas versus Ugin. <laughs> Alright. So we're going to play this Dragon Skull Summit. This is, this is maximum dirtles here, friend. Um, Alright. Uh, I'm going to play Deep Analysis. Yes. As much do. as I miss the Cephalids on the original Torment art. Yeah, Nicol Ball's art is pretty good. Yes. Cinematic. Um, and I have eight cards in hand. Sweet. So we're going to discard a mountain. I'm not even playing a discard deck. Pass. <laughs> I'm my own discard deck. Right. Unclaimed territory. This should have been uh, Cavern of Souls. Just so. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, look, <laughs> you build a five-color dragon deck. <laughs> All right, uh, one, something, something, something. Mm-hmm. Hello, Zeal Crux. Sign of Boogan. Sign of Boogan. Pass turn. All right. Look, Nicol Bolas, it's your nephew. <laughs> Is that how that works? Or niece. Uh, all right, we're going to draw off the turn. Okay, how much mana do I actually meaningfully need right now? <laughs> uh, we're gonna play a Sulphur Falls. Um, I'm gonna make that a slave to Bolus. I guess you have it. Yay! Uh, I'm gonna attack you for four. Slaves. And he dies. Slave to Bolus. Feel bad. 
Avenge me, uncle. <laughs> uh, go ahead. All right. Is it Eugene time? No, not, not quite. All right. Uh, I'm going to play Bell Toll Dragon. Okay. 3-3 three, three Hexproof. 3-3 three, three Hexproof. That's not bad at all. And then I will pass a turn. All right. See, I have an advantage in which I saw you play that deck. <laughs> <laughs> is, is, is that how we're describing this? Um, <laughs> uh, Eldest Reborn. I will sacrifice that. That's why I didn't play Ugin. <laughs> Uh, we're going to play uh, Tapped Fetid Pools and pass to you. Okay. Mountain. <laughs> Indeed. Seven. Uh, Fearsome Awakening on Bell Toll Dragon. Uh, it gets, if it's a dragon, it comes back. Uh -huh. It gets two plus and plus oh, That's kind of nice. Nifty. Big old dragon. Pass turn. All right. Uh, untap. Upkeep. Uh, this. Please discard a card. Ooh, that's kind of fun. All right. This is where the fun begins. <laughs> when you have six Big mana. Big old quotation marks around fun. <clears throat> oh, I have seven mana. Oh, now you got seven. As it turns out, I actually have seven mana. Uh, uh, Oogie. Uh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Is that a thing we're doing now? <laughs> Heart of the cards, Oogie. Alright, so I can get a Scion back, which is not the worst. Um... <laughs> Jordan is very upset with me in chat. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. <laughs> I have done my job. Is this just flying hexproof? Um, yeah, 5-5 five, five flying hexproof. And when it turns face up, all my other dragons get... Oh, it has a megamorph ability. It's oh, megamorph. okay. All right. All right. That changes everything. <laughs> um, Somehow, it changes everything. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, we're playing Nick. Mm-hmm. Um, and we are going to... Ray, if K, you put Shrek in social media posts. <laughs> I mean, I guess you're just going to draw two cards. Uh, we are going to target the, the Hedron Archive, though. All right. I will draw two cards. Thank you. It's exactly what I wanted. Yeah. Yeah, it makes sense. Force the issue. Mm -hmm. Um... Go ahead. Is that a plus four? That's a plus three. <laughs> like a cake. It starts at five? <laughs> yeah, so it's at eight. What? Why does he have nine? Oh. Math. That's different. There's a, these are important numbers. <laughs> yes, absolutely. <laughs> there, there was no dark intimationing. Uh, go ahead. All right. <laughs> these, these numbers are important. All right, first off, yeah, yeah. Nicole Bolas. Absolutely. For five. Uh, and then I shall play a land, and I will play Ugin, and yeah. I will three more. Yeah, absolutely. Because holy cow. <laughs> Nick Bullis is gone with one counter upon him. Uh, uh, yeah, that's that's all that I got for this turn. All right. Would, would you like this Scion of Ugin? Or do you uh, want this? Well, first others? I have to take my draw, guys. Oh, do your draw. Oh, oh, do your draw. Oh, you have, oh, a, you have oh, a very geez. important oh, choice. <laughs> is it left or right? Uh, it's going to be right. Thanks. <laughs> my right or your right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, this goes away. Uh, let's see what is going on here. Um, well, we are going to... Uh, we're going to Dark Intimations. So please sacrifice a creature, Planeswalker. Cool. Uh, please discard a card. Will do. Um, I unfortunately have no targets for... The second part of the good stuff, but I get to draw a card. So sad. So sad. <laughs> How awful. Um, and let's see here. What do we want to do from here? Um, we're gonna play a feather pools tent. And I'm 
many cards do you have in your hand, Adam? Dos. Okay. That's two in Spanish. <laughs> Thanks. It is. Um, we're just going to end the turn and remove a counter from Nick. Sounds good. Attack for five. Uh, I'm a block. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Master of the Unseen. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be a reader for a moment here. It's been a while. Four mana, including one white, and you okay. can manifest at will. Sure, that's kind of fun. Uh, Hedron Archive. Okay. And then... Pass turn. All right, at the end of your turn, I am going to basic land cycle. Do it. This fiery fall. Uh, look at that island. Mm -hmm. Good Anchorman reference in chat there, Zeal Crux. Doodly 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 do. All right. Um, how much mana do you have up right now? Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay, thank you. On tap. Upkeep. Draw. We're going to do that. Um. We're going to play Nick. We are. Uh, starts at five. Um. Let's see. Alright, we're definitely using the plus three, which I'm going to do correctly. Um, I'm debating what I want to target. Um, There's so many to choose from. Haven's the one that brings dragons back from your graveyard, right? Let's see. Okay. But sacrifices to do that. Mm -hmm. um, I am going to blow up Master of the Unseen. Um... Then I'm gonna pass the turn to you. Right, uh, end of turn, I will sacrifice Hedron Archive. Yep. Draw two cards. All right, draw for turn. This is intense. I know, right? <laughs> Good job building these decks, me. Oh, oh! I missed a trigger. <laughs> oh, Dark Intimations was in my sideboard, or was it was in my graveyard? Is it too late for me to do that? Uh, I don't care. Go for it. Okay. <laughs> Counter. All right, and then attack you for five. Okay. All right. Um, cast Ugin. All right. Minus seven Ugin. <laughs> <laughs> So we're playing this game. <laughs> it's the only game I got. Um, I'll play a land. All right. I'm naming dragons. From yes, absolutely. That makes sense. Uh, I'm glad that thing is exiled. All right. Untap. And end of my turn. Oh, okay. uh, at the end of my next turn. Yeah. I thought it was... Yeah, okay. That's fair. <laughs> I thought... Yeah. All right. Uh, we're going to play an island. Um, I'm going to tap some manas. Ooh, so we got six on top, tapping four. We're going to deep analysis again. Mm -hmm. uh, draw two. two. Let's see here. It's a whole lot of nothing. Uh, That's exactly what Nicol Bolas would say. <laughs> I'm going to play Gem of the Coming. Yeah, okay. I'm going to pass to you. Nikki loses a counter. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Draw off a turn. Play a land. Mm -hmm. um, might as well tap six. <laughs> for as well. Dragon Lord Dramoka. Is that one that can't be countered? Can't be countered, and you can't cast spells during my turn. Okay. Um, sure. And pass turn. All right, end of turn, I'm going to gem of becoming. Okay. Let's see here. So, da, 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 
do 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 The Blind Commander episode of LRR was indeed a lot of fun. We like doing weird, silly stuff, if you can't tell. <laughs> uh, play a mountain. Uh, yeah, the the Fantas deck was the one that I built. Uh, we're going to terminate that. Terminate? Yeah. I guess he's dead. Goodbye. She. she. Is it she? Yeah, Dramica's Lady Dragon. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I'll allow it. I'll, I'll take your word for it. Yes, Adam was indeed the designer of one of those decks. Uh, let's see. Adam has a hand, decent amount of input in a lot of our uh, random products that we make. Helped on the Maria. Have you designed any battle decks that are specifically you? Um, no, no. Um, mostly the Maria. Okay, let's see what we got here. Um, nice, let's. Seven. I'm gonna cool ultimatum. Good. Oh. A creature, discard three cards, lose five life. I get to return a creature. Uh, I draw three and I gain five. I don't like that. That card seems mean. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. Let's see here. Um, I'm gonna tap two to play an Andre Bolas. Mm -hmm. Think that there will be a new cube available soon. Do you mean like a Lumeria style thing or a new version of our starter cube? My, this this deck is ridiculous. Yeah, this deck is real silly. Because the the answer to both is yes, eventually. Mm -hmm. It's just kind of a who knows on what timeline. Sometimes. All right, let's Captain see. Mike Z. Thank you for subscribing. I'm gonna discard an August. starter cube is sooner, as far uh, as I know. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Go ahead. All right. Um. If I can wait this out, you're going to run out of cards before I am. <laughs> <laughs> um, you fool with that cruel right. ultimatum. <laughs> I will untap. Play right. directly into my hands. Um, <laughs> pass turn. Grumble, right. grumble. The timeline where the dragons live. <laughs> Seven for some bullets. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <duh>. um, <laughs> When it, uh, it's going to come in and we're going to destroy the haven of the spirit dragon. In response, yeah, I will do something. its business. Yeah, absolutely. Does it not even cost extra mana? It just, okay. Yeah, it costs. Okay. I was, about to say, I was getting that there. Is, that is nuts good if that doesn't cost anything. I think that's the one I want. I don't, I think Dramok is better than the Scions, um, I'm gonna for being honest. attack with an auger. Oh... No, Mr. Fancy Pants. I know. <laughs> well, in that case, you feel like getting up to some mischief, because I'm going to ghost fire it. Okay. Uh, just three, does three damage. This is a colorless spell? Yep, absolutely. I, I note that. It says it right <laughs> on there. I want to make see if... Uh, uh, we're going to blightning you. Figured as much. Oracle text on ghost fire. All right. Updated. And I haven't played a land this turn. Any target. So I'll put a canyon slam to play. Go ahead. Just so you are aware of future ghost fires, any target it now says, not just creature or player. Oh. Important. Draw for turn. Um. Don't do it. Don't do it. I'm go I gotta do it. Minus seven. Okay. <laughs> you know I gotta. Wow. This is, this I don't want to. <laughs> this is amazing. This was not All a right. play pattern I kind of anticipated, but it's but. wonderful. <laughs> I mean, it's... They're it, evenly matched. It's okay. That's, that's how that... As long as Nicol Bolas comes out first... <laughs> yeah. It's whoever comes out first is, is in trouble, because the other one right away can take care of him. Uh, Mind Claw Shaman, please reveal your hand. I have an Ugin's Insight. Is that an instant or sorcery? It sure is. I can cast this... X is the converted mana. All right, so I get to scry five. five. And then draw three cards. All right. Yep. That's, that's, a, that's a good one. Yeah. 
All my blue mana was very helpful. <laughs> there are six in there? Six <laughs> islands in there? Four or six so islands. I mean, these are blue mana, but Thank this is not a dragon. Zero crux for the bits. All right, well, I keep up on a bit of a rider that affects mm -hmm. thousand. You're my, keeping up with my. Your, my plan is working. Absolutely, no. <laughs> you devious monster. Um, I'm gonna lightning you just to bolt you. I'll For the take most three. part, the uh, Go ahead. errata update that's changed to any target affected like 99% of cards. There's only like two or three specific ones that kept. Uh, what I'm gonna soul manipulation that. Sure. Do I have any creatures in my graveyard? I have an auger bolus. bolus. Yeah. Oh, value. Yeah. Go ahead. Oh, this ticked down. Sure did. My Mine turn. is going to tick down at the All end right. of this turn. Untap. <sighs> okay, well, um, you have no cards in hand? I do. I'm going to torment you for a lot. Sure. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that torment, it turns out, is real good. Yes. Uh, yeah, no, but the, the, the dragons, sweeping dragons, is pretty ridiculous there. It's good fun. Oh man, God, you're gonna, gonna turn me into a control player, guys. <laughs> yeah, Arena did that to me. I got, I got sick of playing mono Blackwell red. Blackwell J, this is the finals of our Spark Madness bracket. Uh, Spark Madness is the thing we did with Hipsters the Coast, where people could submit a NCAA style bracket. We put 32 of the Planeswalkers that are showing up in War of the Spark on the bracket. Uh, eight, over 1,800 people submitted those brackets. We took the most common Final Four, once you crunched all the numbers, which turned out to be Ugin, Nicol Bolas, Jason, Lily. Uh, these are now the finals. They are fighting. I built silly thematic but decently powerful decks for them. And yeah, that's what this is. Are you taking the play, Adam? Uh, yes. Sweet. We are using a modified commander rule for the Planeswalkers. They live in the command zone. When they die, they get a cooldown counter for each time they've died. You have to, at the end of your next turn, remove a cooldown counter. You cannot cast them if they have any cooldown counters on them, and I know I'm out of breath. Um. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is bad. Okay, I'm okay with it. So wait, you said there were 32 Planeswalkers. Mm-hmm. There were 36 announced with stained glass art. Yep. So presumably you didn't put the three new ones in, so there was no Davriel, there was no Wanderer. Oh, there's no Teo, and then the... Uh, there's a fourth uh, one who was unnamed. Like Corinna or something like that. Um, there's a sweet remember. movie poster right, out, right. Yeah, and it's got all the names there. on there. Yeah. Um, Real quick, just gonna go to the bracket. So I assume it, again, considering that there were four newish characters, those are probably the ones that were not included. Let's see: Nicobolus, Jung, Dovin, Kiora, Teferi, Narset, Gideon, Ob, Liliana, Ingress, Sor, Nahiri, Vraska, Ob, Healy. Just listing planeswalkers. Chandra, Huatli. Ooh. Uga, um, Arlen, Ash, this Yon, is somehow a little worse. Oh so no! We'll, we'll go down to five. Oh no! Yep, no Davriel, and then the three complete unknowns. Sure. I really like that Davriel card, though. Yeah. Okay, art will never obscure the, the, the rules text of a card. <laughs> <laughs> Except for Dabriel. Zeal Crux, Jace was supposed to be the mill deck, but Ugin, it turns out, does a mild impression of it if it needs to. <laughs> Just waiting it out. Just like Liliana was supposed to be the discard deck, but Nicol yeah. Bolas is doing a decent impression <laughs> of that. Well, you have two Blightnings, and it turns out when you draw them both within the first five turns, two games in a row, it does work. All right, you know what? I'm just going to keep this and right. see what happens. I will leave that on top. Dragons. Okay. Pass turn. Uh, Canyon Slew tapped. Pass. Island. Go. Lovely. Alright, we're going to play a Drowned Catacomb. Mm -hmm. uh, and then we're going to play an Augur Bolus. Excellent. Let's see what happens. Nothing. Go ahead. Yeah. Just uh, as I planned. <laughs> Augur Bolus kind of has to go in a Nickel Bolus deck, but right. it is not the oh, no. best Augur Bolus deck in the world. Sometimes it hits. Um, all right, let's see. What's the play? Oh, we're in tech. Ninety. Um, play swamp. And we're gonna blightning you. Okay. Let's see. I have some things I will never be able to cast. <laughs> I'll just throw those. Sign of Ugin and uh... Deathbringer Regent. Ooh. Okay. Oh, I don't know why Agabrolis is dying. That, that's not making any sense at all. Uh, <laughs> go ahead. This is the sacrifice for the gods. Deathbringer Regent, spicy one of. Fast turn. All right. Well, the good news is that I don't have exactly the fastest clock in the world, but 
Um, all right, we're going to play uh, tapped fetid pools and attack with mm-hmm. Mother Boss. That's 15 turns and I'm in trouble. Go ahead. Island. Oh, no. Pass turn. All right. Um, Augur. And I'm going to cast Deep Analysis. You, you've Certainly. solved the future Ugin's insight problem, at least. <laughs> um, and we are going to... I love this art. Don't look, Simon. Okay. Mm-hmm. It's so good. Is I'm going to play a tapped Crumbling Necropolis and pass the turn. All right. Pass turn. Not like this. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> it's part of the game. <laughs> uh, sulfur falls. Um, I'm gonna auger. Um, I'm gonna take an imp's mischief. It's one of my favorite weird cards. It's a fun one that was uh, featured in Game Nights recently too. Really, yeah. uh, attack with auger. Um, and... That and Withering Boon are cards that Black should not have in yet. Mm. I like Illuminate. I'm going to flashback Deep Analysis. Um, and that puts me at eight. I'm going to discard another Deep Analysis. Go ahead. Draw. Pass turn. End of turn, I'm going to Basic Land Cycle, a Fiery Fall. Hmm. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think I see where this is going. Yep. <laughs> uh, we're going to blow up the unclaimed territory. No, my only five color land. Yeah, all right, we're going to attack for two. All right. Well, this is, this is unfortunate. <laughs> uh, go ahead, Adam. Ha ha ha! Oh, no. <laughs> Naming dragons. Oh, we should have named something really, really, like, uh, <laughs> artificial. Well, I, I, I don't plan for this to go away anytime <laughs> soon. Go ahead. Naming right. brushwag. Oh, I have to do it. You said you weren't planning on it to go away. <laughs> um, I am going to, in Bolus's clutches, your unclaimed territory. <laughs> you own it. It's legendary also. Wow. Yeah. Uh, and then It is claimed now. And then we're going to go up and blow up an island, so double stone <laughs> rain you. Um, and then fine. attack with two augers. That didn't hurt. I, I so I've, I I had that in my hand for a lot of the game Nicola last Bolas time, and I really wanted jerk. to steal your Ugin, I so I would just have both of them. Yeah. Um. But uh, I'm gonna pass to you. All right. Aha! Swamp. Aha! Pass turn. <laughs> what are you gonna do now? <sighs> the disrespect is so real. <laughs> <laughs> um. We're gonna do this. Um. We are going to. Uh, we're gonna ultimate. Okay, so, I'm down to two. And I attack two blockers. Yeah, all right. We don't have to do the rest of it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, brother. Thanks, Adam. It was a good match. Okay. <laughs> Here's your unclaimed territory. Oh, back. thanks. Well, there you have it. After an extremely hard fought game one, uh, Nicol Bolas kind of a uh, going a little curb stompy there. Yeah. Game two. Uh, so plans according- millennia. In the process of come to fruition this day. Uh, I would like to thank all of you, my players here, for helping me okay. scientifically determine who is the greatest planeswalker of all you, time. You heard it here first. This is how the end of War of the Spark goes. Nick <laughs> Bolas just obliterates everybody. Mm-hmm. It's a big, big downer for everybody involved. Uh, except big, for Nick Bolas. Big <laughs> downer <laughs> ending. This is actually the last set that Magic is going to release. They just didn't want to announce it that way. <laughs> uh, so, Nick Bolas wins, uh, opens the gate to Phyrexia, the universe dies. Uh, the end. Yay. Good stream, everybody. Good <laughs> uh, Thank you all for joining Thanks, us. Thanks, folks. Uh, War of the Spark presale is officially live on Card Kingdom today, so you can go get all of your nifty spoilers. I plan on buying out Fibblethip. And, uh, yeah. Thanks, everybody. Have fun. Bye. And go Bye. buy a bunch of cards. Bye.